The Connebada Petroleum Park Authority was established in 2008 by an act of national parliament, but it has seen little development since its creation as the overseer of a free trade zone connected to the PNG gas export sector. During question time today, the member for Hiri Koyari, Keith Irihu, questioned the government on the status of the Connebada Petroleum Park Authority. Number one, what is the status of the KPPA today? Number two, the NEC decision number 15 slash 2018 directed an investigation into this, this authority and specific instructions to ministers where is this report. In his response, Minister for International Trade Investment Richard Maru was direct, stating that an investigation had been conducted and submission had been done and given to the government. He's being appointed Minister of uh, the Konebara Petroleum Park. Mr. Speaker, I want to confirm that there was an investigation into the affairs of the Petroleum Park, and I can confirm that land has been sold all over the place. It has not served this purpose, and a lot of people have made a lot of money out of that um, park. I've now taken a submission to Cabinet to immediately appoint the um, board and management of the Special Economic Zone Authority to preside over an investigation and see what we can do and come back to Cabinet within three months on where the assets, is there any way we can repossess the land, what monies are left, what bills are outstanding so we can inform Cabinet and make recommendations on the way forward. Mr. Maru stated that the problem started from the initial stages in the agreement when no agreement was done for selling gas locally. Konebara Petroleum Park, the problem started with the way we negotiated the initial PNG LNG agreement. In that agreement, there was no DMO. It's important the Parliament understands that. There was no provision made for gas to be used in the local domestic industry in the initial project agreement. We've had investors from Japan sitting and waiting to access gas from the PNG LNG project to process in the Konebara Petroleum Park. But the current owners of PNG LNG have not made any gas available because it was never in the agreement. In 2018, a report was released by the National Research Institute describing KPPA as a scam and called for immediate abolishment. Rocky Iso, National MTV News.